Hey everyone, welcome back for more Exos Heroes content. Today's video, we're going to discuss the new Choice Fate Core Re first anniversary. So this will begin on November 19th after the maintenance. It will continue up to November 25th. So let's take a look. Take a look at the Choice Fate Core that we have. So all of them are blue Fate Cores. Um, I think Eden is, is not here because um, he currently has a banner still up. So the four choices will be FC Rachel, FC Tupaki, FC Garf, and FC Yao. And uh, if you can see, um, the, so the cost of summoning them or recruiting them for the first recruit, it's 200 Zes. And after the first recruit, it's 7 Zes. So take note, once you've selected one of them, you can no longer select the others. So it's best that you decide uh, decide um, clearly on who or which fate card you'd like to recruit at the beginning. I'll discuss it more on that later. So if you can see that some... Um, oh, sorry, before I proceed... The the, the 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 chance to drop for this these freight cores are 0.5 percent so the core mileage will be deleted when uh, choice fate core ends so adjusting buff targets of several blue fate cores so to move on there were a couple of um i think there are two who were adjusted so it's uh, black moon baraka so the difference now is that there were a couple of um heroes added the the blue ones are <coughs> are those who have been added recently so now it includes garf redley and other notable heroes for fc yao if you can see um fc yao also has added uh Estorish republic heroes so basically um each nation has their own designated uh fate core because the bonuses for 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 blue fate cores depend on which nation you are I'll, I'll give you an example so right now i have two uh blue fate cores i have eden so he grants buffs to greenland heroes so and i have uh, black moon baraka already so he grants buffs to waste wasted red heroes so if you can see here the um, the power the combat power attack hp and defense are buffed so if you can see, these are just a very small on just one Fate Core. The goal for Blue Fate Cores is that you get at least two copies of them so that once you get the second one, you once you fuse them, the HP, I think, goes to 30% or up. And the others, I think, are are up to 5%. I'm not sure. I, have, I haven't tried uh, fusing them yet. But it's a big buff. So ideally, for blue fate course, you have to you have to decide number one on which heroes do you have right now that you want to develop, and which heroes that you don't have that you want to develop. Um, you might be a beginner or a, a mid player or a whale. You'll have to decide on this eventually, depending on which heroes you want to choose. Because I, I'm sure you you I'm I'm I'm. I'm not recommending that you get all of the blue fate cores. You just focus on the ones that uh, most that you, most of your heroes will will benefit from. Okay, so now we're back here at the the fate core choices. So to help you decide on who to who to pick, um, again I'll I'll just repeat myself. It it depends number one on which heroes do you have. Number two it also would depend on which heroes you would want to develop but i'll just run through a uh, some of the notable heroes that belong to each fate core here so for let's start with fc rachel so rachel he he gives buffs to lenombe um, nation heroes so he gives buffs to himself no, notably zeon and morris those are the most notable um, heroes that he gives buffs to for FC Tupaki, he gives buffs to North Von Frosty uh, heroes. So you have their Iris, you have Brooke, Shufraken, Valentina, Ramji, and Lepin as their notable heroes. For FC Baraka, 
in which personally for me i'll try to pull because i already have a copy of him and also i'm, I'm actually tempted also to go for fc yao uh but uh, let's go through first with with fc baraka so fc baraka gives again buffs to wasted red nation heroes so notably garf rudley otard annie scarlet hekin and maggie and the last is fc yao so she gives buffs to Astoria's republic heroes so namely Janai, notably Janai, Adams, Luke, Emma, and Jin. So guys, it's really up to you on which do you want, which do you prefer, which do you need. Again, another tip for FC Rachel, you can use him um, for signature force if you want to pull for him because he's a general. But the rest are just uh, are just uh, your your basic heroes. So again, guys. Um, Please write down in the comments below uh, what you think of these Blue Fate cores and which do you prefer. Um, also, please try to support my channel by subscribing to the button down below. You all stay safe guys and this is The Warden and I'm out.